We are having a great time here on ISS. Sonny Williams and Butch Wilmore never thought they'd still be on the space station in mid-July. Ignition and liftoff. Of the two lifted off in their Boeing Starliner spaceship on a 10-day test flight back on June 5th. That was 36 days ago. The trouble began as Starliner approached the space station. Five engine thrusters shut down. Four came back online and Starliner was able to dock safely. NASA also discovered several helium leaks, which they believe are minor issues. But the thruster trouble makes NASA nervous and engineers want to fully understand it before approving Starliner to return to Earth. So ground teams are trying to replicate the problem while the crew remains up there. But Boeing has struggled with Starliner engineering setbacks and delays for years. It is still billions of dollars uh, over budget, years behind schedule. It seems it's been snake bit at every turn. Are you confident in the performance of this ship for future missions as well? This is the, the world of test. This is a tough business that we're in. Human spaceflight is not easy. Failure is not an option. That's why we are staying here now. But Wilmore and Williams came without their suitcases because at the last minute, NASA had to lose weight in order to add a critical piece to fix a toilet on the space station. So Butch and Sonny have been borrowing clothes from other crew members on station. Butch and I have been up here before and it feels uh, like coming back home. As for coming home, NASA says it hopes to have its thruster test results by the end of next week. The prime option today is to return Butch and Sunny on Starliner. Um, right now, we don't see any reason that um, that wouldn't be the case. Now targeting late July for Williams and Wilmore's homecoming. I have a, a real good feeling in my heart that uh, this spacecraft will, br will bring us home, no problem. Yeah, NASA also says Starliner could come home now in an emergency, but it really wants to completely dissect this thruster problem because the thrusters sit in that portion of the spaceship, the service module, that is designed to burn up on reentry. So their only chance to understand this problem before they lose the evidence is now. And by the way, there's plenty of food and water on the station. I don't know about you guys, though. If somebody borrowed my clothes for a month, yeah. I think I'd say, you know, the, you keep them. You have, Just, you you're good. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Exactly. You're right, Tom. They really seem like happy as clams. Yes. Delightful. Yes. yes. And I love the hair. Yeah. I know. I love the yeah. hair. Absolutely. Thank you, Tom. Thank you. Let's All get a right. check of the weather. What's I, going on? I would love the hair. <laughs> <laughs> Perfectly honest. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.